All right, what is up everyone? Welcome back to the channel and today uh, we have some exciting news for myself and also today is game day so that's another thing to really get excited for. But uh, if you're, you probably noticed by now, the audio is a lot different on this video. Uh, I got a mic, and this mic here, uh, it is a fine mic. Um, it's pretty dope. I honestly, I really like it a lot. Um, it, it, it's, you know, it's a smaller mic, which I like because I don't really like, like, these big things. I also don't need, like, that big studio mic. Um, but regardless, you know, it's my first time kind of using one of these. I literally just got it, like, half an hour ago, so I've been trying, like, trying to tinker around with it and stuff. I've done a couple different videos uh, of just recording myself, trying to figure out the best volume setting. I think I have the best one here. Uh, but regardless, today is game three. I'm going to do a little bit of a preview here uh, for this game because this is a big game here for the Flyers. You, most of the time, whoever wins game three of the series usually wins the series. So this is a huge game uh, for the Flyers, especially when you're coming off a game two loss like that. You really want to redeem yourself. So the Flyers, they know they have to redeem themselves. Uh, a couple things. It looked like Travis Konechny was at practice today, which is definitely a good sign uh, because, it's, you know, as I said in the in the game review for the last game, Konechny, he blocked the shot, went down, uh, and he did not return. He went off the ice limping, so he was there. Uh, also, Oscar Lindblom skated today, which was amazing. Uh, he's now in Toronto. He's actually, he was in Toronto for a little bit, but this is the first time he's actually hit the ice. So that was definitely good news to see. Uh, and, you know, the Flyers, they've tried to tinker around with the line a little bit. Looks like you now have a stacked top line again of Jeruk, Terry, Voracek. Looks like Lawton could be the third line center. You could have Faraby on your second line wing. Um, so they have changed a, a little bit of stuff there. Um, I believe the defensive pairs will still be the same, and I and I and so Carter Hart would be a net. But this is a huge game for the Flyers. Honestly, I think whoever wins this series, uh, or excuse me, wins this game will win the series. Um, and, you know, and honestly, it, it, it's it's going to be tough. I mean, I really think the Flyers are going to come out with a bang, and I, I really do. I'm predicting, uh, I'm, I'm going I'm to really be predicting like a, a really profound win tonight. I'm really thinking they're going to really take it to Montreal. Because as I said, I mean, that last game, you know, the Flyers, they didn't show up that much. And the Canadians, they played good, but I think if the Flyers matched what they could, you know, gave their best effort and what we've seen the most of, I think the Flyers still would have won that game regardless of what Montreal gave. The Flyers just did not show up at all in that last game there versus Montreal. So, again, uh, it, it, it will be a good game tonight. I'm excited for it. Remember, the game is at 8 o'clock on NBC. Uh, and, again, it's going to be a huge one. I'm hoping the Flyers can pull out a victory. Uh, we'll talk to you guys tonight after the game. And, again, uh, just let me know below anything you want uh, to see, maybe with the mic, if it's too loud or anything like that. I can definitely adjust the volume and things along those lines. And I, I'm sure I will learn more as I go. Uh, so, again, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys tonight. And let's go Flyers.